Bennett Academy, coming off a third place finish in the Montini Holiday Tournament, is back at home with a big test in front of them. That test is the Dowling Catholic Maroons from Iowa, a team that finished as a state qualifier last year. The Maroons showing why. Caitlin Clark misses the three, but Dowling gets the offensive board. And then Grace Gaber is there for the three-pointer, 11-7 Maroons. DC also making noise on defense. Caitlin Clark gets the steal and lay-in, start of a big night for the Iowa commit. Second quarter now, Red Wings with the ball. Brooke Schrammick gets the and one shot to go. Free throw, also good. 23-10 Maroons early in that second quarter. It's now 27-18, the Wings still fighting. Lexi Moriarty hits a three to cut the Maroon lead to six, 27-21. Just before the half, the score sits 29-23 DC. Clark misses the J, but Lexi Bowles is there for the putback buzzer beater. 31-23 Maroons at the break. Third quarter, Kendall Holmes bounces into a shot. She hits a three. B.A. down just five now, 31-26. A few possessions later, Holmes feeds it to Allison Forney, and she sinks a critical three-pointer. Suddenly, it's just 33-32 Maroons. But that Maroon defense at it again. Clark gets another swipe and goes for the layup, 35-32 Dowling Catholic. Score now sits 42-33, D.C. Holmes, a 23-point night. Here's two of them. Deficit still at seven. Now 44-35, and Clark said, whatever you can do, I can do better. Gets the buzzer beater to end the third quarter. 47-35, Dowling Catholic headed to the fourth. B.A., though, still trying to chip away. Brooke Schrammick also with a 23-point night with a pair of them here in transition, 47-40, D.C. However, Clark and the Maroons simply too much. The star player with 36 points on the night, Maroons win 69 to 58. So we didn't know much about this team, but we knew they had a lot of D1 players, so just preparing for that. And we knew if we just played our defense, we would be able to shut them down. I think the first quarter really set the tone for us. So I thought we played really well. It's a lot of fun. I mean, you don't know a ton about them, if, and you don't play club basketball against them much, and they have a bunch of club players that are D1. So it's fun getting to play these girls. It's different for us. It's great competition. So we love coming to different states and playing. We're never going to give up in any situation. Like, we were down, I don't even know, like 17, like you said, and we kept fighting. We brought it back within, I don't know, like one. And unfortunately, we weren't able to uh, keep going and pull out the win, but I think we can take that positive away. We had a really tough start, I think. We were down like 25 to 7 or something, and that's usually not like us. So after the game, coach was talking about having better beginnings of the games. And then towards the end, we started to fight back a little bit, and Kendall was knocking shots, and we were drawing the fouls, but in the end, we just couldn't get it.